take a look outside. This is our Daytona Toyota and Deland Kia camera in Daytona Beach. Record crowds are in town for the annual music festival. Welcome to Rockville. But with inconvenient weather on tap for some of the weekend, some fans could leave disappointed. Just last year, a series of severe storms caused the cancellation of performances by two headlining bands. Yeah, then yesterday, storms caused a temporary evacuation on opening day. News 6's Molly Reed talked with the promoter how they are preparing to keep fans safe. Over 170,000 fans are expected to pack here into the Speedway for Rockville this year, and it's the largest crowd that they've ever had for this music festival. But with dark clouds looming overhead again today, many fans say that they just hope to see their favorite bands perform. I think sevenfold. I think sevenfold for all of us. Let's see. Sleeping with sirens. I prevail. It's a heavy metal and rock fans paradise. The infield of the International Speedway transformed with stages that will hold over 95 bands over the four days, including headliners Slipknot, Tool, Avenge Sevenfold, and Pantera. There's like literally nothing else that comes to this town. Like every festival is like in Miami or in LA, and it's finally cool to have like a rock concert come here. It all takes weeks to set up. Teams with the promoter Danny Weimer presents preparing for everything safety and weather wise too. This is even getting bigger now. This is our third year here and we're expanding. The first day yesterday was interrupted by storms with the temporary evacuation. Fans had to go to cars or the grandstand. An hour later they were able to come back in and the bands picked back up. It was good. I mean getting back in kind of sucked like the line got long. But for some it was a sore reminder of last year's cancellations due to a series of storms. Ah, it was brutal. Festival MC Jose Mangan says the team is monitoring weather around the clock and spreading the word quickly on social media and on jumbo screens if there's an issue. Imagine something happening to somebody because they didn't want to stop the show. The fans say they're ready to take on anything Mother Nature throws at them, but hope for sunnier skies going forward. We're hoping for better weather this year. I mean, it is Florida. You know, it could be raining on this side and sunny on this side. So, you know, it is what it is. In Daytona Beach, Volusia County. I'm Molly Reed getting results, News 6.